Hey, Spotifyers, click or tap the banner to listen to Good Vibes. Set it off with these epic anthems. Only Good Vibes here. guys welcome back to my channel again so if you've already watched part one of this trip you know we reached our hotel very late last night but we still wanted to get up super early to explore Mont Tremblant it started raining yesterday and continued this morning as well we quickly did our breakfast in the hotel itself and got ready to leave around 11 time to see some breathtaking views As you can see, it did not stop raining, but we continued our way ahead in a hope that it will stop once we reach. Alright, finally we're here and ready to park. Still raining a bit. some 
accommodations which are mostly fully booked year-round as they are super close. Let's move ahead. Mont Tremblant is the number one ski resort in Eastern North America with a lot of activities and events to keep everyone entertained all year long. Tremblant welcomes you with newly updated mountain facilities and a European-style pedestrian village with world-class lodging and amenities, restaurants, boutiques, hiking and biking trails and all kinds of things to do. Mont Tremblant gondola rides are really famous and available throughout the year. They're a fun way to enjoy the splendor of the Mont Tremblant views from the top of the mountain. We're just heading there to grab our tickets. Let's comfortably sit in the panoramic gondola and admire the view for a few minutes as we reach the summit of Tremblant. <laughs> I got you! <laughs> Good one! <laughs> This is beautiful. Wow, what a ride. We reached the top in approximately 10-15 minutes and trust me, we have never seen Mont Tremblant like just we saw now. The rainy season views here are just as breathtaking as any other season. As soon as you reach up, the first thing that you see is the Grand Manitou. It's a quick service counter situated on top of Mont Tremblant, offering a wide variety of simple food choices. It's time to eat now. Have you experienced a view like this before? Let me know in the comments below. It started pouring again once we finished food, but we still wandered around a bit to see the beautiful sights around. Missed seeing the 360 degree observation tower this time, which is otherwise a must during a visit to the summit. It is accessible via a 2.5 km trail and takes about one hour to complete. It started raining more heavily, so we decided to head back. Fogged while returning back and the views as you can see turned more beautiful. Definitely turning out to be a very unique experience. We're 
were back in the village now and wanted to do another experience which is the luge ride. It's a three-wheel cart which you run on a 1.4 km trail full of twists and turns which run through the forest. You ride the chairlift to the top of the track then jump on board on your cart for your downhill ride. I would recommend you to get your tickets online as the lineup is really huge there and it was almost closing time for the ride when we reached. So we couldn't experience it this time. Time to explore some more activities in the village. Let's go. No trip is complete for me without beaver tails. Let's dig in. The small trips I take every year gives me time to pause and reflect. This year has been full of realization so far. Realization that we only have a short lifetime on earth, so make the most of it. Realization that the things that matter today or make you stressed might not even matter tomorrow. Realization that you don't need people's validation to be happy. Just find what makes you happy, keeps you smiling, and stick with it. Does not matter whether it's big or small, what makes you happy is worth it any day, any time. I feel like Alice in Wonderland. Time to head back to the hotel. Let's go night. And here begins our Bollywood road trip once again. Nature kept playing games with us on the way back home. It rained for a while and then there was sunshine and then rain again. We had such a good time today. Time to celebrate with some wine. It's day three and we're heading home today. Bye hotel. This was a short and sweet trip but we made so many memories on the way and now making some more memories heading back home. Who's the most fun? 
Yeah. Left on Long Road. Who makes the food in the relationship? Who's the most talented? Who's the most adventurous in the relationship? Who spends the most money in the relationship? <laughs> Who's the best kisser? Nobody said it. Well, man, I got the. Who takes longer to get ready in the morning? This, this one. It, it takes forever. Who's the bigger baby? One sec. Uh, Raju. Who loves the most? Who gives the best massages in the relationship? Last question. Who will be the first to die in the relationship? Okay, so I'm gonna ask you a few questions. What is my favorite color? Black. What is my favorite movie? I think even I don't know this. Favorite movie. Kalhuna. Kinda, kinda got a point. What is my favorite song? You know this. Kalhuna. What, what is my favorite song? Kalhuna. That's my second favorite. Chale 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 chale. What is my sign? I was born at home. Okay. Thank you so much for watching guys. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed.